many chances, denied by the woodwork. Um, but then two probably soft goals to concede. What's your assessment of that performance? Uh, my assessment uh, about the performance is, uh, <laughs> is, is positive. And if you ask me about the, the final result, and um, uh, for sure I'm not happy. And uh, it's the same for my players, because I think uh, at the end we decided much more in this, uh, in this game. It was, uh, was really difficult to, is uh, really difficult to explain the first half, because uh, mm, uh, we were to kneel down, uh, despite, uh, I think, uh, we showed a great desire, a great will. Uh, and uh, we pressed well, uh, and we created also chances to, to score with uh, a post. And uh, we finished the first half uh, to kneel down. And I think this type of result can kill uh, everything. But not uh, my players, not my team. I asked them to stay into the pitch uh, with, with the head, with the heart, and to continue to, to do what we, we prepared. The second half, uh, I think uh, that we deserved uh, much more, much more uh, that we um, we reach at the end of, of the game. We score one, uh, one goal with Harry and uh, with uh, another crossbar. And uh, Allison, uh, I think maybe he was the, the best player for for him. He made uh, good saves. A good game, a good game, despite the the difficult moment that we are facing. Because, uh, I repeat, um, we are facing uh, uh, managing a situation very difficult. Uh, and, uh, today Perisic played the uh, first striker with uh, Harry. A positive thing um, to see Kluseski again uh, uh, into the pitch. And uh, we have to try to manage uh, more uh, well because he continues to have a pain in his attendance. And then uh, yeah, uh, I hope now to tomorrow to see in the training uh, Richarlison. Uh, this uh, could be also a good, uh, good news for us. A very good summary of that match. Um, Fabio Paratici, your uh, sporting director, came into the tunnel and he said it was a shame that the team had only been given four minutes extra time and that a hundred mistakes were made by the officials. What do you think of the decisions that were made? No, but um, but I, I continue in the same way, you know, because you know that I don't want to comment referee decision, but for sure. With uh, with the referee, with the VR, uh, and Tottenham is not lucky you know, in this uh, this season. Uh, no. Yeah. Um, you talked about Kuliseski, who had an immediate impact as well, and we have seen Richarlison here with the team. He's walking quite well. Your assessment of Kuliseski of Richarlison going into another busy week before this international break. No, I think I think that uh, now uh, um, Kuluseski was a good news to see him uh, uh, to play for for 20 minutes. And now tomorrow we'll see also Richarlison. I think uh, could be uh, available for for the game uh, for uh, for uh, for Wednesday. I think that uh, we are trying to to do the best also for the players. Don't take stupid risk because uh, uh, it's not correct. And um, we did this uh, with uh, uh, Deki, and now we are doing the same with uh, Richardson. For sure, for a team like uh, like Tottenham, and uh, it's important when you have a season uh, with the Premier League and Champions League. It's important uh, to 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 have the all players available, and uh, because uh, when you uh, you lose. Uh, two, three, four players, uh, you pay, you pay, you have to know this, you have to know this, and uh, I hope in the future, uh, maybe uh, with the club, uh, we try to understand this very well and to reinforce the squad to give more quality to face this type of situation, but I repeat, and uh, um, we did uh, well, and uh, because uh, this process, in my opinion, as a uh, just started and continue to repeat always the same thing but um, the club i think uh, is going in the, in the right di direction thank you very much